Now it's time for high school softball going up on a hump day. Defending GISA AA state champs Windsor taking on the 8-1 and one ace Lady Griffins at Friends Field. Let go! Scoreless game, bottom of two. Lady Knights keep it that way. Sierra Ussery in the circle with the strikeout. No hits allowed in the frame. Top of three. Ace does the same thing. A Mary Elizabeth Ballard with the strikeout. They call her Meebs. To end the inning, it's a no-no going on both sides. Top of three, Dixiana Sims. She gets the home team on the board with the fly ball that's dropped and left. Scores Taylor Ann Martin from second. Then up next, Destiny Lucas goes shopping in the gap at right center. And in comes a hustling Sims from second base, touching home plate. Ace leads two to nothing. But not so fast, my friend. Bottom of four, Sierra Ursery trying to keep things close. She stays alive with back-to-back -back strikeouts, keeping the margin at just two runs heading into the fifth. Windsor at bat, runners on the corners, but Lizzie Mitchell has other plans. She guns out the would-be stealer at second with the laser to Dixiana Sims. That ends the inning, and the threat still 2 nothing. Ace Charter. Next inning, same scenario for Windsor, but this time Lola Newberry comes through with the fielder's choice, scoring Gracie Swift, who beats the throw at home and cuts the lead in half. Tied 2-2, same inning, bases loaded for the Knights, but Dixiana Sims pulls the trigger, gets the whiff, and out of the jam. Ace rallies back in the bottom of seven with a walk-off single from Charlotte Lavotte. The Lady Griffins finish on top 3-2 and improve to 8-1 on the season. Other scores to report, Veterans gets the victory over Perry 8-7 in eight innings. Olivia Brown, the senior, closing the game for the win. Hawkinsville takes down Trutland 9-3. Northside all over Peach County 15-2. In Jasper County, they shut out Howard by a dime. That's it for my report. Marvin James, 13 WMAZ Sports.